Thousands of the Federal Capital Territory Abuja Indigens stormed the National Assembly demands weak his resignation as minister over alleged land racketeering. Hey there, you're welcome to Trending with VOS TV. A large number of indigents of the Federal Capital Territory Abuja and civil society groups on Wednesday held a massive protest calling for the resignation of Nia Sombike as Minister of the Federal Capital Territory. Bring you unnecessary distraction to the government. Yes. We as responsible citizens, we cannot accept this kind of uncalled in the chorus person to continue to pilot the affairs of your city. Yes. The protesters who stormed the National Assembly complex said that the weakest administration was incompetent and lacked vision for the Federal Capital Territory. Weekend must go. Nigeria stand united that weekend must go. Weekend must go. He is an unnecessary distraction in the FCT. But President go. Bola Tinubu must remove weekend as minister of the FCT. He is bringing unnecessary distraction to the government. We as responsible citizens, we cannot accept this kind of uncalled in the chorus person to continue to pilot the affairs of the FCT. His actions are avoidably controversial and hurting and his diction has been foul, combative and condescending as if he is a deliberate punishment sent to the people of the Federal Capital Territory by President Tudubu. In years and weekends, a length penchant for land grabbing and cronism has begun to emerge as some of the land reforms are suspected to be targeted at dispossessing Nigerians of their properties and reacquiring them through cronies. There is tension in the FCT today under the brutal and sometimes criminal wiki is coming menace. His recent clash with the governor of River State, Sir Sim Similar Epuvara, isn't just a mere political disagreement, but a display of dirty politics that has no place in a civilized society. Wiki's preoccupation with personal Bendata has diverted his attention from his primary responsibility, neglecting the critical objectives set by the federal government for the FCT. Wiki's high-handedness in land policies, the revocation of lands, perceived animosity towards a particular section of the country, and the alarming manner in which lands are allocated risks of high-level corruption. It is evident that the actions of Mr. Wike do not align with the government agenda for reforms and development in the FCT. Mr. Wike's tactics, reminiscent of an emperor which is exhibited during his tenure as governor of River State. And these are detrimental to the progress and growth we seek for our FCT and the nation at large. Do tell us what you think in the comment section below. Stay tuned for more trending updates.